Okay, you guys, we're on a little hike on Vancouver Island in the rainforest, and it's absolutely gorgeous. And I'm crossing over a suspension bridge right now, so take a look at this. I don't like it, it's not comfortable. And it's a great analogy when we're following our dreams, right? We leave the comfort of the life we've known, and we want to get to the other side, which is our dream, which is our vision, and there's a gap in between. And so we have to cross this gap. So much easier when we have a bridge, which is often coaching, mentorship, structures of support. And yet, in the middle, here we are in the middle on the suspension bridge, it's a little wobbly, it's a little uncomfortable, it feels like a long ways down. So let me just show you here. Here we are. It's also quite beautiful here. Not always the case when we're in the middle of building a dream. And this is the part that can be a little scary, can be a little uncomfortable, but it's essential as we're building our dreams to, to dare to cross the bridge, to dare to be a little uncomfortable. And as I'm here a little bit longer, I'm feeling more comfortable. And you know that highly successful people are willing to be uncomfortable for the sake of growth. And the more we're willing to step out in fear, in the uncomfort, it gets easier every time. But know that this is the gap. This is the gap. So crossing the suspension bridge, it's a little wobbly, a little insecure, um, but trusting, trusting the process. And it will take us all the way to the other side, all the way to our dreams. And we're gonna go see some beautiful vistas here on the other side. So here we are in the rainforest on Vancouver Island, building dreams. All right, we just are walking back up from seeing the ocean. The tide was high and the waves were crashing. It was absolutely beautiful with the sun shining on the waves and there was a few waterfalls right off of the beach. Absolutely stunning and well worth crossing that bridge for. There are so many lessons and analogies uh, watching those waves and even though they look maybe a little uh, intimidating and they're blowing strong, you know that there's perfection in that and the way that the tide comes in and the tide goes out. There's so many beautiful um, perfections in nature and I think sometimes when the waves are blowing in our own lives and it feels like things are out of control, just trusting the process that that serves a, a purpose as well. So it was so nice to cross that bridge and do it afraid and what was on the other side of it was certainly worth it. Got to experience the ocean and got to experience it with my daughter. First time for her seeing the Pacific Ocean. So very, very special. What's the bridge that it's time for you to cross in your life? Maybe you're in the midst of, you're in that middle of the bridge, it's feeling a little uneasy, it's feeling a little unsteady and you're not sure you're on the right path. Trust what's on the other side is absolutely worth it. Keep your eye on the prize, which is in this case your vision. So what would you love to create? Keep focused, keep taking those steps and oftentimes in the middle of the process it feels a little turbulent, feels a little wobbly but trust that you are in the right and perfect place. Here is to you living a life you love.